Mort, is the cure ready? Yes. Loaded for dispersal in two minutes. Procedure traumatic for Reed, but not lethal. Malin's research invaluable. She's okay? Headed to safety now. Her survival fortunate. We'll stabilize new government should Rex get any ideas. Good match. Promising future for Krogan. Damn! Control room at top of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes. Manual access required. Have to counteract STG sabotage. Ensure cure dispersed properly. Morton, this whole thing is coming apart. There's got to be another way. Remote bypass impossible. STG countermeasures in place. No time to adjust cure for temperature variants. No. No other option. Not coming back. Suggest you get clear. Explosion likely to be problematic. Morton, no! Shepard, please. Need to do this. My project, my work, my cure. My responsibility. Would have liked to run tests on the seashells. You're crazy, Morton. But you're a hell of a scientist. Glad you realize it. Why I had to be here. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. A long time ago, my father betrayed me in this place, his own son. He tried to kill me, so I had to kill him, right over there. That's what the genophage reduced us to, animals. But you change them today, Shepard. Now we'll fight for our children, not against them. It's just a pity Morden had to die. He told me he had to do it. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. He got it right for everyone. A thousand years from now, we'll probably be singing songs about him. <laughs> uh, I'm sure he'd like that. But you, Commander, we can thank you in person. Tell the Turians I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. Goodbye, Commander. What will you do now? Spread the hope you've given us. Even now, there are clans gathering in the Kelphic Valley. I'll go speak to them and make sure this gift isn't squandered. Thank you for all that you've done. And know that Erdnat Bakara calls you a friend. So I don't want to be buzzkill, but uh, how, how do people in the Citadel get the cure? Hell of a thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Rex has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. 
I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Hackett, out. Commander, Erdnot Rex has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. We're going to need you. Don't forget where we live. Never. It's clear we all fight together, or die. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... It can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut-eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. Anything happens, you let me know. Oh, Jesus, what happened to my face? Oh, right, yeah. It's open. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? Thinking of some friends who aren't around thanks to this war. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? I miss Caden. <laughs> oh, no. No one I want to talk about right now. I understand. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. He called the comm room? The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. Commander, there is something we should discuss, if you are finished rewriting history. I made my decision, Counselor. There's not much anyone can do about it now. Yes. We're going to have billions more Krogan in the galaxy. It's a good thing you saved my life once, Shepard. Otherwise, well... I have concerns about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. My agents have discovered that he's using his authority to move vast sums of money. For what purpose? We're not sure. Why bring this to me? Put Citadel security on it. You are a human and relatively neutral politically. Your backing would help me ease through... Well, let's not speak of it now. Come to the Citadel and grant me a moment of your time. You may find it interesting. Valorant out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? The good news is we're managing to win in some sectors. The bad news is we're losing in others. I'm encouraged by our order of battle, though. It seems to be working. We just need to stick to it and pick up the pace. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Erdnot Rex running the show is a bonus for us. And that female Krogan you rescued is rallying more support from the other clans. I'm glad you disabled that mom and Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support as it is. We picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. 
How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back us. Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. These STG guys know the score. They're not gonna jeopardize the entire Solarian Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful, and violent. Mostly Vorcha, I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Darner Vosk is bringing his men, and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, but whatever you did, it was worth it. What about the Rachna? I wouldn't have believed it, but the Rachni are helping us build the Crucible. You're kidding. Turns out they have a knack for weapons of mass destruction. In hindsight, I guess they'd know a thing or two about waging a galactic war. No problems with them then? Other than scaring the hell out of our engineers, no. Not a lot of small talk going on there. Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Heard not Rex has deployed troops, and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Irun. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight. Though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. Do you know anything about the Hanar and Drell? Their luck is holding. For now, the Reapers have avoided a direct invasion of that sector. Though we've heard Drell wet war teams are mobilizing fast to shore up their border with the Solarians. I knew a Drell. The Reapers don't want to tangle with them. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. So, <clears throat> so you might be thinking yourself, um, fuck, Morden died. What a terrible ending and things like that. Well, I, I want to actually go over that. Because I looked into that, and um, there isn't really any way of keeping him alive uh, that's favorable. Because uh, you have to do two things. You have to first, uh, Rex must have died on Vermeer, and it, when Rex dies in Vermeer, then, or not, Reeve, I think it's Reeve, the guy that was in the other uh, car that died, um, he will be the clan leader, and then he'll be guiding you through all this, and he's obviously not as loyal to you as Rex is, because you and Rex have, like, a lot of background. So, so Rex needs to be dead, which is not okay with me. And the second thing is, you need to have not saved, uh, Malin's data. Uh, and then basically you get to convince him at the very end that, uh, that they're not worth curing kind of thing, and then Morden will, uh, not go up there and die. So he, he only goes up there and dies because he believes in stuff. Now there is actually a special renegade one. If you're if you're trying to do the the path where like the you allow the STG um, sabotage to take place, uh, and this is a renegade thing too. So he will try and go up there, obviously, uh, to try and stop the sabotage. Anyways, um, this is if you don't convince him. So you to not convince him, you must have not saved. Uh, so you, you either saved the the data or Rex is alive kind of thing. So he'll try and go up there. And so you can actually prevent him from doing the things with the cure by shooting him in the fucking back. Yeah. Go figure, huh? So I I, I didn't want to exactly do that. Um, I mean, you can look it up on YouTube. It's like a, it's one of the things that, one of the outcomes of that. 
Uh, you know, fucking horrible, man. So, we're basically at the military strength that we can basically go do the end of the game. Or, I mean, total military strength and then effective. I'm not sure what that means, but whatever. I mean, we're just doing everything, and I'm, I'm like, it's whatever, so. Clan Erdnot, Krogan Clans. So yeah, we got a lot of shit now for this. This is like game winning right now. Terrain 7th Fleet and the uh, Terrain Engineering Corps. And I think that's it. Yeah, there's nothing else. So, I don't know, I was just telling you how that how it goes down. But like, for me, as I said, Krogan are my bros, so... Fucking, I was always gonna side with them. And fuck, I mean, fuck the Slarians. I mean, Warden is cool, but, yeah. I said, if it's a choice between Rex and uh, Morden, I choose Rex every time. Commander, Sorry. Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter base on Navaria. The Turians have given us top-level access to their combat data. Their ships are already moving in to help the Alliance fleet. You actually secured a Krogan Turian alliance. It's one thing to hear about Commander Shepard. It's another to see him in action. Commander. Hey, you know how the saying goes. You can either fight at my side, or get crushed under my heel. You will not stand in my way. Alright, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start of combat? Uh, I give up. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Alright, big guy. What do you call it when a Turian gets killed by a horrible spiky monster? Friendly fire. Come on, that one goes back to Shang-Chi. How you gotta respect the classics? How many humans does it take to activate a dormant mass relay? 602. 600 to vote on it, one to ask the Asari for technical help, and one to request a seat on the council afterward. How do you know when a Turian's out of ammo? He switches to the stick up his ass as a backup weapon. Why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? You're, you're shitting me! The Turian military has one about me? Oh, absolutely. I heard it myself from a private back on Palavin. All right, why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? So their Marines can beat someone in hand-to-hand -hand drills. <laughs> Damn, you need to tell James that one. Hey, what's the hardest part about treating a Turian who took a rocket to one side of his face? Figuring out which side took the rocket. <laughs> Those are great. <laughs> Never thought I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. I'm sorry about Morden. If not for him, we wouldn't have the Krogan Alliance. He'll have a hell of a tombstone, cured the genophage, with a little asterisk, and then at the bottom it'll say, which he also created. I always thought he was crazy. Useful, but crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? <laughs> I guess not, but he was one of ours. So now that we got the Krogan and the Turians, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? That works for me. So how does it feel knowing Krogan will be singing songs about you until the end of time? I think it would be an honor. To be honest, I did it so the Krogan would help your people. And believe me, it won't be forgotten. Our fleets will be there for Earth. I'll make sure of it. I know you will. And let's hope Rex keeps running the show on Tachanka. Maybe we should hire a food taster for him. Imagine the carnage if someone like that brother of his Reeve took over. It could happen. I know. It's a chance we have to take. But I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have taken that Solarian deal. I'd be lying if I said I didn't consider it. Anyone would have second thoughts about the Krogan. They just better remember you didn't act on it and return the favor. Dude, the neck does not go back that far. What the fuck? I wonder where all the Krogan will live now. I've never seen what you'd call a house on Tachanka. I wonder where all the Krogan will yeah. live now. I've never Commander? Commander? Oh, Edie's gone. 
Uh, we gotta find out why where she's at. And remember, we will continue to completely ignore the, the final floor. Commander, you've got a new message at your private terminal. Yeah, thanks. Oh god. New article on Reaper. Uh, Zoo's hope said to be survivors of a savage geth attack several years ago has repelled initial re Reaper landing attempts. Uh, colonies are home. I wonder if we can go back there. Uh, yeah, I helped her back on. This is the person I helped on, the green skin person on the uh, Ilium. Uh, I wonder if we can go see her. We'll be, we are leaving for us soon. When the time comes, we will fight with you. I, I guess I get that as a war asset. It's kind of neat. I mean, I thought they were just a shitty colony, though. Uh, General likes me. Or not Rex. Making babies again will be fun. <laughs> we're off to save the Turians now, since apparently they forgot how to hold a gun. Yes. Thank you, Rex. And Dalatras. Well, apparently did not like, uh... Slayer and Union did not like my decision, but they can go fuck themselves. I don't even know what I got. Zeus Hope calling us. Yeah, there you go. I'm actually sort of surprised that, like, they actually turn out to be war assets. Ah, uh, nothing over here. Well, we know we don't need to talk to, uh... Where the fuck is, uh, Edie? Uh, I do like how they move around the ship, though. It's kind of neat. Any sign of life? The Reaper destroyed by the Thresher Maw appears to be completely inert, Doctor. We would need to send in teams to be sure. Out of the question. Tell the Krogan to stay away. All right. Ah, here we go. Intel from the Battle of Octorisk. All right. Let's have a look at this one. So we're going to do weapon damage bonus or shields. We are definitely doing weapon damage bonus. There you go. Easy. The genophage cured. The Krogan have no reason to hold back now, do they? Rex knows what he's doing, but can he keep the Krogan in check? Or will this Eve's oh. organizing the female Krogan? She reminds me of some of the more formidable matriarchs I've known. The Krogan won't let themselves fall by the wayside again. Not like they did after the rebellions. We'll have to get used to them having a bigger part in the galaxy. I hope the Krogan live up to their ancient legacy, and for the better. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. Good to see you. There is new information on the private messages terminal. Oh, not the private messages terminal. I, I, dude, you might as well call that thing, there's new messages on the Caden terminal. Then, then I'll definitely know to ignore it. <laughs> oh god, I miss Caden. Dude, we never talked to him, how's that even a fucking option? Hey, uh, what do you think about Morden not being here? Hello, Commander. Nothing, alright. Oh, hey, she's here now. What are you up to now? I'm uploading data on the destroyed Reaper to the Turians. They are investigating possible Reaper structural weakness. Our data says Reaper capital ships such as Sovereign are of unique design. However, smaller Reaper destroyers bear similarities. That one was small? Relatively, yes. Ground attack ships are only 160 meters in height. Sovereign was approximately two kilometers. Well, keep talking to the Tyrians. If there's a chink in the Reaper's armor, we all need to know it. Racism. Hello, Shepard. How could you say something like that, Shepard? There's a what in there? I mean, you know what? It could be literal. <laughs> you never know. Because <laughs> the Reapers are made out of people. Holy shit. You could easily take that out of context, I'm just saying. I thought we were in the future. Settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of the ship is strong. How so? 
I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And a drill. There was illness in him. Pain. And the Krogan we met, who lived in these quarters. He was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. But reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the Cosmic Imperative. The strong flourished. The weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion? Or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. We can't afford any weak links in this war. They drain our resources. They can become a resource of their own. How? Oh. If the Reapers are busy conquering the weak, they are not watching you. So, use them as a distraction? All strategies must be considered, and few are too extreme. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. Maybe. Or maybe you'd still be a soldier. I do wonder sometimes. Living a life of constant war, taking life in every battle. Does it get to you? It shapes me. A stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it would take. You and I, Commander. War is our sculptor. And we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this, and we'll both be set free. Thank you, Commander. I have seen the death of a Reaper. It has been a long time. Let's hope it's... If the cross is retribution for the past, do not waste time on sterility plagues. Destroy them where they stand. In the meantime, they are useful cannon fodder against the Reapers. Every time I think that they're done, but I press spacebar again. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. Do not care what others All think. Alright. Do what you must. I don't think there's anyone else really around here, yeah. So let's go back to the bridge and uh, call, it, call it up. Fuck. Alright guys, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.